Hey everyone, it's Jessica. Um, just doing a check-in. Surgery, two more days. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. It's Monday um, at 7.30, so I've got to be there at 5.30. Um, I'm really excited. I started coming down with a cold, like a runny nose and sore throat. Um, kind of on Wednesday, but I was kind of holding it off. And then Friday, it was like, I was exhausted. I went to the doctor and I got a doctor's note to... Um, excuse me, um, take the weekend off, so, uh, sorry, I'm moving my legs and the computer's moving everywhere, uh, so I got a doctor's note, so I got, I got the weekend off of work, because I was supposed to work Friday night, Saturday night, I worked 12 hour shifts in the night, so I knew I was just going to be, I was going to get sick for sure, so right now I think I'm, you know, I'm doing okay, I'm sleeping and drinking lots of fluids, I'm airborne, and the sugar-free Theraflu, I've only taken once, but, um, I'm feeling pretty good. They did a strep test at the doctor's office and it was negative, so it's probably just a virus. Oh, I hope I get better for Monday. I hope they don't cancel or postpone the surgery because everything is planned for this Monday. Like, everything, like my entire school schedule. I took off time from school. Um, what else? So, besides school, I've got work. I've got a month off from work because of this. So, everything is planned because for this Monday. So, I just hope everything goes as planned. And of course, I want to be in great health. I want to be in my best health, too. So, pray for me, please. Um, the other thing, um, the fluids. So, this is day Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. This is Saturday. So, this is day four of my liquid diet. Um, I noticed a change yesterday. It was a little bit better. Um, of course, being around food, I was at like, um, my clinical. And people were eating in front of me, and I just wanted a bite of something. But it wasn't like I'm dying, I'm like starving, my stomach isn't doing these tricks on me, or my mind's not doing these tricks, and I'm like starving, and I need something, so I feel a lot better now. Um, today is, yeah, the day four, and I haven't even had a protein shake today, and I know it's kind of bad, I'm going to plan to have one, but I kind of wanted to save it for special, and I'm kind of getting tired of it too, so, like the other day, I, like, it, I had to force myself to drink it down, um, and I only had one, so, um... They want me to lose weight for surgery, right? So that's what I'm doing. I was at 282 when it, um, when I went to the doctor's office, and today I was at two. On uh, my home scale is 280.4, so I'm really excited. It's going down a little bit. I accidentally turned it off. So, like I said, it is going down a little bit. It is exciting. Um, another thing that I wanted to talk about was um, I've I've been seeing all these videos like with like the food the um, the food hauls, and I think they're great, and I'm so excited because can't wait till I can start buying things and I can start eating again and um it's gonna be a while though because my surgeon doesn't even have me eating puree foods till like four week four like week two and three are cream soups and pudding a diet pudding and of course jello sugar for jello and popsicles and stuff like that but I can't even eat like puree food till week four and that's a long way away so the month right fine for the better good of society. <laughs> um, okay, so I've been seeing all these things and a couple of questions I have because what I have learned, um, I am a nursing student and I've gone through all these chemistries and nutrition and what I've learned is protein, especially like protein shakes and stuff, you don't make them hot and um, I've heard people that putting them in like hot foods. If you put protein, um, proteins like, you know, a, a simple strand, if you put it in something hot, it will break down. That's why I like when you flat iron your hair, it's a protein, and it gets hot, and it breaks the protein, so that's why it straightens it out for a little while. Um, so I was curious, like, if you're really getting the benefit of the protein, if you're putting it in something hot. Um, also, um, two videos talked about turkey bacon, and there's one that said, like, 30 calorie turkey bacon, which sounds really good. It looked really good, too, because I think it was, um, Mary Jane's video, and it would look like a real piece of meat, like not just the fat, you know. Um, that looked really good. But I saw Dr. Oz talk about turkey bacon the other day on um, a special Oprah, and they said that turkey bacon has the same amount of calories as regular bacon, but it's almost double, it's like more than double the sodium content. So um, I just watch out what kind of turkey bacon you guys are buying, because you might as well just have the regular bacon if, I mean, because otherwise they're basically the same. They <laughs> made a really funny joke, like, how are you going to make a turkey into a pig? So, it probably wasn't that funny now. At their point. Um, what else is going on? 
I have to just try to clean up my house and sleep and just try to hang out. Um, I am feeling a lot better. If I could just, um, I am feeling a lot better. So, hope for me that I feel better and that everything goes smoothly on Monday. And, um, I'm probably going to be really excited and make like a last minute video on my way to the hospital and, um, post that afterwards. I don't know how to use my camera and I don't think my camera has a lot of memory so I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do any videos like my pre-op videos which I really want to do. I love seeing those like it's kind of exciting um, but we'll see. We'll see how that goes. Um, other stories. I really need to be more organized and make a list when I do this. I, will just, I do ramble too. Mm. Okay. Well, I guess I'm going to let it go, because that's all I can think about right now. Okay, take care, everyone. Um, thanks for everyone posting great videos and all your responses to my videos. I appreciate them, and I love your support. This is a great community. And thank you. Take care, everyone. Bye.